Hi guys, welcome to Zatu, another edition of our unboxing. Today we're looking at the board game Evolution, and I'm joined by Mitch. Hi. And Mitch, you're in the office of unboxing that today? Yes. So the premise of the game is that you and your fellow players, with your herbivores and carnivores, create a dynamic ecosystem. So Mitch, you want to tell us what we've got in the box today? Okay, so we have lovely game manual. We have this lovely player aid sheet, which also has all the traits in it, as well as a fun little scientific name generator, because in this game you'll be creating species. And based oh, on that's those, quite fun. Yeah, and based on their attributes, you can then uh, sign them a name. Do you have to use that? No, it's not a, it's not mandatory. It plays no actual um, role in the game. Oh, that's good. But it's, but it's just fun. Just Depends on imaginative and creative yeah, you are. Yeah. I think a lot of the fun in this game actually does come from the player's imagination anyway. We have the primordial pool. This is where you'll be placing all your food each turn. It's quite cool. Primordial pool or watering hole. Or primordial pool. Or watering hole. The food tokens. Oh, okay. Now these are double sided. So at the start of the game everybody starts out as a herbivore. So uh, you'll just be eating the food that's placed in the primordial pool. However, later on, you might become a carnivore, at which point you'll start eating other people's species and you'll need these meat tokens. They do look quite tasty for They do species. look tasty, nothing like a little bit of zebra leg. So we have the game bags. So one of these for each player. And these are where you'll be keeping the food, because at the end of the game, it's the person with the most food that will win the game. Okay. I quite like the detail on them as well. Yeah, these are actually really nice. Each one is All unique. Each species in there. So you can have whichever one uh, you think suits your most prominent species most. So there we've got this species board. Yeah, these are the species tiles. If you can get into them. If I can get into them. Quite well packaged. Yeah. So during the game, you'll, well, you'll start the game with one of these. And during the game, you can create any number of these species. So there'll be the, one for each species. Mm -hmm. Yeah, each species will have one. And, they'll, and they denote the population size as well as the body size of each species. And this will basically denote whether you can attack other species, how much you'll take if you eat one of them, um, and how much food you can actually store. Because if you don't have enough members of the population, you can't eat that much food. We have this. Thank you. The cubes, these are literally just for moving up and down these species boards. So, for example, you have one for body size and one for population. So what you got there? This is the first player marker. And what a mighty first player marker it is. What would you... I guess it's uh, Brachiosaurus. Brachiosaurus. It is worth mentioning this game was uh, mentioned in Nature Journal for its uh, ability to help teach kids about the uh, ecosystem. So that's quite a nice little feature. Yeah. And this is basically the core mechanics of the game. Each turn you'll have a hand of these, you'll discard, uh, discard one, put food into the primordial pool. The rest you'll play either as traits on your creatures, making them either fertile or foragers. So basically using the trait cards to modify your species. Exactly, exactly. Up the food chain. Yeah, so I mean, you've got ambush there, which is a primor um, primarily carnivore attribute. You also have carnivore, which is an attribute in there, which actually allows you- right there. Yeah, it's which it actually lacking. allows you to start eating meat in the first place. But you have to make sure obviously that you're much bigger or at least smarter than your prey to make sure you can score those, uh, very, those tasty I, food points. I very much like the artwork on on the whole game in general. You've got the artwork on the food bags, which are great, and mm -hmm. they match yep. artwork on the cards. Yeah, so this is actually a second printing. Uh, the artwork has slightly changed uh, between printings, making it a little bit clearer on these tiles for the population and body size, coloring them. Well, that's it for the unboxing of Evolution today. Yeah, a really nice, simple, eco-building game for uh, all the family. I think everyone will have a good time playing it. Yep. Remember that you can buy Evolution from our online store here at Zatu. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow the rest of the videos that we do. Yep. Thanks for watching. Thanks very much, guys.